first week. I, I think I'll feel relieved, plus uh, it's sad to have to give up. And uh, I kind of thought there'd be a lot of extra people come in that used to come here from many years ago. And we appreciate that. Uh, I told my wife that I guess they was showing respect for us. And uh, it's kind of sad that I won't be here next month, but uh, I'm still at home. Uh, I live in the same house and going to for a while. Uh, I just got to where physically and health-wise and old age that I can't do the things I used to do. Uh, it's been in the back of our mind for a couple of three years and we just hated the thoughts of coming to uh, grips with it and just say this is it. But wife and I decided uh, several months back that we gonna have to quit and so we announced last month here when they had the picking and grinning and the hot look that we was gonna make this the last one. Well, I've seen young people married and got children grown themselves, and that's kind of an enjoyable thought. And I, I certainly miss some of the elderly people that uh, uh, have gone on to their great rewards. That's kind of sad, but as I, uh, I've said before, there's probably more young children in bluegrass music than ever been in history. But they're not here to fill in the spaces for the older ones that no longer can travel this far or that are just unable to be out at night. So uh, when we uh, were running festivals, uh, uh, most every weekend, well, we had little business cards and told about it and hand them out. And, there were always uh, new people coming in as the uh, older ones dropped out, but that's not available anymore.